My grandmother was a very avid gardener. She was president of the gar local garden club. She was very much an inspiration to me. She loved uh, plants, and, and so she was very much an inspiration to me. And then my dad has, has uh, absolutely has, has been inspiring too because he loves plants also. I spent a lot of time back in my early part of my career with the orchards, but have always had some hand in the, in the boxwood. We grew a few plants up here in the field, but we saw a, a bigger market for bigger plants, which we did not offer 20, until about 20 years ago in numbers. You know, we had a handful, but we saw a, a good market for it, and we, we rose to it and started planting some of this stuff out, and here we are. Through probably my junior year in college, this was not, it was absolutely was not what I was going to do. And, and then something happened, and I don't know, I, I can't put my finger on what that thing was, but, but it, it hit me there in my senior year in college, and I was like, wow. And, then, and so I ended up back here, and it, it, this is the only place I've ever gotten a paycheck from. I'm the engineer of Saunders Brothers. I'm, you know, helping figure out how we can move down the road. It's a pretty cool farming job. You know, I'm not sitting on a tractor all day. I'm not out there milking cows all day. But, they, but we are doing agriculture and we're doing, we're doing good stuff. When you're making plants that make people happy, I'm not out there taking something from someone, making them life miserable or, or whatever, or trying to be a shyster. I'm out there making their life better, giving them something to make life move down the road. The journey's been fun. I've mostly been a, a grower for until the last about three years. Um, and I've grown everything from annuals, perennials, most of the woody shrubs, but growing quality product, uh, giving back to the community, giving back to the industry, and uh, hopefully leaving the world a better place. We, we work with uh, you know, a lot of Hispanics, Hopefully, we have made their life better because they have known us. They've get emotional here. They've certainly made our life better. Uh, but working with people and beautifying the earth is is just it's it's peaceful. It's peaceful. It's it does a lot for the soul, and I enjoy uh, I enjoy that. When I graduated from college, I worked away for six years for the extension service. And then in 91, I decided I wanted to come back and help out here. As the business has grown, my role has changed from um, shipping. I did a little bit of purchasing. And then I, I moved into human resources. I'm in charge of it all and making sure that, you know, we got the right people here to get the jobs done. My interest is not as much interest in the plants because I don't, that's not where my talent is, I don't think. I think my talent is in kind of helping find the right people that fit into our business now. And that, that, that's what's really been fulfilling to me is to bring team members in and, and they enjoy what we're doing. They enjoy the, the, the company that we have and they're part of our company, they're comp part of our company culture and our company family also.
I wake up every day and check fruit, check boxwood quality and grow plants. Um, I think the biggest thing is giving them water, but uh, um, the biggest thing, yeah, is, is trying to grow quality plants and quality fruit. There's an expectation for quality um, and, and I'm trying my best to, to make sure that we send out quality, both quality fruit and quality plants. As far as the next generation bringing things to the table, I think certainly that we bring a different perspective, uh, certainly a different age demographic to the company. It just urge those thoughts along. Maybe we should change. Maybe we should look at doing this based on current customer demand. So I think we do bring some different things to the table, but maybe we see some changing things that maybe someone else doesn't see. Yeah, working, working here is really great. Uh, we, we love our family atmosphere and the people that work here, we don't look at them as, a, as just a number. We constantly strive to get to know them and make them feel involved and, and our team here, the, the people that work here is, is what makes it fun. Uh, we constantly challenge each other to, uh, to think a little harder and to dig a little deeper into how to do something or a certain process. And the teamwork is, is uh, very synergetic. The next generation, we're all, I'm 31 and my cousins are 28 and 29, I believe right now. So we're, uh, we're ready to rock and roll. I was bound and determined to not return. I was like, I'm going to go off and do something different and be rid of this. Um, and then as I left and got another job somewhere else at a different nursery, um, I realized I really missed home. You know, you just learn to love what you grow up with. Our generation is more you know, we're really excited and ready to get into the business and try to add our spin to it. Um, we're really just hoping to make our mark.